we are getting ready to do some Christmas cookies. Just some regular cut cookies. What are they called? Sugar cookies. Sugar cookies, you know, the kind that you make and you cut out of the, with cookie cutters. And we're gonna make some, we're gonna eat some, we're gonna freeze some for Christmas. And look what came in the mail today. <gasps> I'm starting the vlog today, and look what Elfie did. Little red Hello Kitty place. It looks purple on camera. And a blue little penguin place. And he wrote us a note. And there's Hello Kitty and a penguin. Yeah. So it says, Sophia and Gabby. Santa is almost here. I have hidden two Santas in the living room. Go find him. Elfie, P.S. Here's a hint. Can you hear bells? Let's go find it. Oh, a Christmas tree. Did I say that this is like Santa? That doesn't have bells. Good morning, guys. It is super early. It's still dark in the house. I hate vlogging when there's no light. But anyway, oh, what am I doing here? I'm standing there staring at it. Look up, 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 Wow, it's adorable. All right, let's keep looking. Let's see. I just have these candies. Alfie hit it at adult eye level. Let's see. It's so adorable. It's got candies in the bottom. All right, let's keep looking. Let's keep looking. Could it be in the presents? Could like look up. Oh, I see it. Can you guys see it? Get it down for me. You oh, see I see it. it. I see it. Get it down for me. I checked there like five times. Look at them. Who would put them up there? Elvie must be able to fly for sure because that is so high. You're nice and old Elvie. What do you say? That is super cool. I love it. <laughs> Looks like you bought these at the dollar store. Yeah. Well, Santa probably makes them and takes them it's to the dollar store. 150, does it say? Yeah, good job. Sylvia's been learning all about money and it's working. She's getting it. You're getting it. Super cool. Santa has bells on. You guys, it is almost Christmas. Holy cow. It is flying by. I just keep thinking there's so much to do, oh, yeah, but there's nothing left for hardly for us to do. We've got all of our presents wrapped, most of our presents wrapped. We still have a few things um, due to be delivered that have not been delivered yet, which is a bit scary. Found it. I know what it is. Yes. I knew it. Chocolate. I'm gonna eat this. Oh, I'm having this? Yeah, because I'm gonna eat this. Wow, thanks. Wow, Gabby does. She's been giving us treats. Actually, Sophie is the one that usually gives us treats. Yeah, I already gave one to you, but you gave back. Yeah, I don't like to take candies from my babies. Mm. And it also looks like Santa has red hair. Things are getting busy at our house. We are getting ready to do some Christmas cookies. Just some regular cut cookies. What are they called? Sugar cookies. Sugar cookies, you know, the kind that you make and you cut out of the, with cookie cutters. And we're gonna make some, we're gonna eat some, we're gonna freeze some for Christmas. And look what came in the mail today. <gasps> Santa letters. How do you know it's a Santa letter? Because we always get one. A letter from and Santa. <laughs> wow. Awesome. What can it be? What can it be? 
Could it be? What could it be? We've got our cookie dough in the fridge getting cold. It's going to get nice and cold for us to be able okay. to cut it out. A lot of reading. A lot of reading. This is our schoolwork. This is our schoolwork for the day. Can you read it to Sophie? Wow, Soph. Girls are messing up the kitchen. Sophie's been having some chicken noodle soup. Gabby has got this big mess going on and these are cookie cutters that we have getting ready. This table is never gonna be clean, Look is it? This. It says, Dear Sophia, Postal Elves just dropped off your letter this morning and Mrs. Claus read it to me as I made blueberry pancakes for breakfast. Your letter was full of joy and color and it made our day, thank you. Mrs. Claus put your letter in her kitchen cupboard where all her favorite cards and pictures go. It obviously made her very happy. She calls her cork board the wall of fame. So that's, that must mean you're famous now. Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> Santa's village is full of Christmas lights and sparkles. These days in the school grounds are dotted by snowmen with carrot noses, black coal buttons, and colorful fluffy snow wooden scar woolen scarves. Right guys, I'm out and about and for some reason the temperature just dropped. Dropped like crazy. It's freezing outside. It's minus six degrees. You know, that's not that cold in Canada right now, but I mean, usually it's minus 20. So it's kind of warm actually, but it's actually cold. Especially when you're not used to it. So I'm out to go get some, go shopping, get some stuff. A lot of stuff I need to get, so I'm going to definitely go get those mouse traps today. And I don't know if I, sh I should show you this or not. I let uh, Sophie take the shovel to the car, the last big snowfall. And this is what happened. This little tiny plastic piece. Little tiny plastic piece. Right there. Shoots water onto the windshield. It shoots water in the windshield. And you know how much that little plastic tiny piece costs? $46. So hopefully it'll come tomorrow in the mail. It's supposed to be here tomorrow. But $46, can you believe it? And I think it's for two, two of them. Hopefully it's two of them. I only need one, but I don't like paying $46 for one little piece of plastic. So I'm gonna go get some glue. I'm gonna put the glue on there, let it dry, because it's nice and cold out before it starts snowing some more. I'm gonna let it dry so the water just doesn't shoot up. <laughs> I noticed it last night, because when the window was all dirty and I turned on the washer fluid and I just had a stream go right up in the air. So now I have to try and get that. But I ordered the part and that's like uh, $46. Crazy, crazy how much a piece of plastic costs. If I had a 3D printer, I wonder if I could print one of those. All right, I failed. Failed miserably, I'll tell you why. I went and bought this hypoxy stuff. Okay, I bought hypoxy. And I figure all I need to do is plug up that hole just so that it doesn't squirt up. Just so it doesn't squirt up. See it? No sooner do I squeeze this little bit on there and it it's everywhere. Got all over my hands, got all over the hood of my car. I was like frantically looking for paper towels to wipe it all down. Yeah, that was a mistake. Cut the hood of the car all filled with glue. Had to wipe it down before it all hardened up. So I think I did the job, but I got like a little bit of staining there now. All that glue, now I gotta put snow on there and try and wipe it down a little bit better. So it doesn't ruin the hood of my car. And it was snowing earlier, so I was thinking, oh my gosh, snowing, yeah, what's gonna happen? But anyway, it's all taken care of. Wow, I come in and it smells wonderful in here. Look what Laura made. All these cookies. Yummy. Yummy. It's official. Literally, my kids have traded in baking cookies for Heartland and marriage proposals. I was like, I just kept saying, come on, come on, help me make cookies, help me make cookies. Nope, they don't want to, this is what they're doing. Aha! Uh -huh. Heartland again, did he propose? Did he finally propose? No. Oh my gosh, what season are you on? Six. 
Literally, these kids are obsessed. I've never seen them obsessed like this over any kind of show ever in my whole entire life. It's insane. So I was munching on these yummy cookies. Laura put some icing on it, but I don't like the icing. I like the plain ones. And look at this cookie. Look at that cookie. Now that is one warped gingerbread guy. Hey, what's going on? Who made this warped cookie? Wait, let me see. I don't know. <laughs> I made one Sophia made. Who made this warp cookie? Gingerbread man. And mom called it dad. What? Your mom said this was shaped like me? <laughs> With a big belly? Yeah. Your mom said that was me. Yeah. Your mom said that was me. Yeah. What's going on in this room? Did he finally propose at least? Yeah. Yeah, he already proposed later. Already proposed? It was that Cool. Anyways, you guessed it. We've been all day in this room watching Heartland. I keep calling it Horseland, but it's Heartland. Anyways, uh, that's pretty much it. We've done nothing all day. You guys haven't done anything all day, have you? Well, you're coloring. Make. You coloring now? Yeah, I'm. We doing school, so we're doing this with your dog. Well, that's cool. At least you're doing something else other than watch TV all day. Hey, I'm watching and coloring. Anyways, getting cold out. Like I said before, getting cold. Winter's coming. Winter's coming. My favorite show is um, Game of Thrones, and that doesn't start till like April sometime. But winter is coming. All right, so I'm gonna end tonight's vlog and we'll see you tomorrow. On day by day, bye. And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.